Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's your man Jay Will. So, Black Friday 2018, it's been pretty decent. Uh, this year, um, I had to set in my mind that I was going to replace uh, one of the TVs in the house, just my bedroom TV. I felt like I, was, I needed to upgrade that. Now, I have smart TVs throughout the house, but the one in the bedroom was not, it's a little older. It's maybe three to four years old, maybe. And um, it, it might be even older than that. And it was time to go. So, I got to Best Buy and they were sold out of all of the t two TVs that I wanted. Uh, a 65 inch um, LT TCL TV was $399 and I missed that. I hate that I missed it, um, but you know, it, it was, it was going to be a good one. So if you got that one more power to you. However, I did get a nice TV for $400. Uh, it's regularly $450, but it is a nice TV. It's got HDR, Dolby Vision. It is sweet. I don't know if I'm going to showcase it on the channel. I did showcase my other 65 inches downstairs in the living room, uh, but I wanted to replace my bedroom TV, and I thought this is going to be it. And I was going to put a 65 up here too, uh, and I could have got other, gotten other 65s, but I wasn't just buying TVs. I wanted something with Dolby, uh, uh, Dolby Vision or HDR and a wide color gamut. That's what I wanted. So I got that. I got all of that. You know what I'm saying? So, and I also got a very thin TV and I got it on sale for $400. So that was just a, it was a win for me. I was excited about that. Um, and I bought the new iPad, um, got the new iPad, the 2018 iPad 6th gen, because um, I didn't do any videos on this, but I bought this, I got this a long time ago. This is a Logitech um, pencil. It's, a, it's an Apple Pencil Alternative. It's $69, and it has a female input for charging. It's got, it feels really good. It's matte. Uh, it's just a, it's a good, good feeling pencil, and it's very accurate, just like the Apple Pencil. And so I got the new iPad, um, so, I could start using that because I, I had I had got that a long time ago to test it on other iPads and I realized it was just for the 6th gen. It really was just for the 6th gen. Sometimes, you know, you get a little work around, but it didn't work. So I knew I was going to eventually get the 6th gen, just kind of waiting for it to go on sale. Uh, so the 6th gen iPad is really, really nice. I really dig it. It's fast. It's not, it, it doesn't feel sluggish or anything. Uh, it's just that, you know, with the 2 gigs of RAM, uh, also, this one has the fingerprint reader too, and I'm really enjoying that. Again, I, I mean, we still have the 9.7 iPad Pro, uh, but this iPad right here has an 18 Fusion chip, and it is fast, man. Once I got it set up, it's it's blazing fast. I mean, no, I, I didn't think that it would be slow, uh, but the camera's recording 1080p at 30 frames per second, and that's cool with me. You know, I'm not really, I didn't get that to to you know use as a primary iPad. It was 249 bucks, and I think that was a good deal for the 32 gig Wi-Fi. Uh, and it has pretty much, it's, it's an iPad, so it works. I did a backup from my iPad Pro 11. Everything is on there, everything is working good. It's flawless, just like the other iPads I have. So, um, but the difference is, I now have pen input without buying Apple's uh, overpriced pen. And I got a, the, the, the feel of that pen is amazing. It's Logitech by Crayola, Crayola or Crayon, you know, the crayons or whatever. Logitech somehow teamed up with Apple, and Apple let them get a slice of the pie if they pay them a big chunk, probably. but that pen right there if you have a 6th gen ipad i definitely recommend you get that over the apple pencil you'll save a lot of money and it works just the same now i also picked up a new case for my galaxy note 9 this is the symmetry out of box i got videos out on both of these already but uh so my take this year was just uh, an out of box case and a new ipad and a new tv and i was going to get more than one tv but they just kept selling out so i got the one that i really wanted uh and you know, I just wanted to see what you guys picked up. You know what I'm saying? Leave a comment down below and uh, let me know the, the um, what you guys picked up. And if you got a good deal on something, this Symmetry case is on sale for $29. And I had so many coupons and stuff through Best Buy. I didn't come out of pocket any cash for it because I'd already given them a bunch of cash. <laughs> you know, yes, I'm an Elite Plus member at Best Buy. And so you spend so much money. You just have to spend $3,500 a year there and you can be an Elite Plus. You get lots of perks, man. Like, I think you get like... 45 days returns uh you get um a higher percentage on coupons and all it's a whole bunch of different stuff so um but i really am digging this this out of box symmetry for my note 9 and i just wanted to reach out to you guys it's still black friday you know today is friday november 23rd you know what i'm saying and tomorrow at 9 a.m i think they're going to start doing some more sales again too i'm not sure uh on saturday and then you got cyber monday so the great part about Best Buy, like most companies, Best Buy is really good about it though. 
Uh, like if they drop the price on anything I bought, I just take my receipt back over there and they give me a refund for the difference right on the spot. And I love that. Uh, but I don't foresee this going down any lower than 30 bucks, uh, you know, for this out of box symmetry case. This case is boss, man. I really, I really like it. Didn't think I was going to like it this much, but I, I'm actually using it in the house. You know what I'm saying? Cause I don't use cases around the house, but, um, yeah, I'm, I'm really feeling this case, man. I really like this case. And I think it's really, it's really sweet, man. So I'm going to continue to use this bad boy right here. Uh, with my Galaxy Note, and uh, I'm replacing my White Stone Dome with another tempered glass, so it'll be here. Um, it'll be here to, uh, Monday, uh, and I've got I got some other. I got my new LG speaker in. Also, finally got that in. Uh, don't know how if I'm going to cover that much at all. You know, that's just something that I use. You know, to replace my other bigger LG speaker, but I might demo it for you. You know, I don't know. I got that in, and what else did I get? I got some new earbuds coming in. Black Friday has been pretty good, man. I mean, I hope you guys have enjoyed your, your time with your family, uh, you know. And um, I, I really like the tech deals that they had out there. Uh, there's a lot of stuff that I'm still looking to purchase. Um, I got some other phones coming. I got one more phone coming in that I purchased, and I'm just waiting for it to ship. It got back order, you know what I'm saying? It's the big uh, Huawei phone. Uh, so it's back order, so I'm still waiting. It's still not shipped. Um, it says it's shipping between... It's, it's going to start shipping. Now the date moved to November to December 1st. They keep moving this date back, man, and they're not shipping my phone. So uh, yesterday it said it was shipping from the 22nd or the 23rd to the 25th. So I just check it right now on video, and it's not shipping until um, it says December 29th to November 1st, which is bogus, man. They told me it's going to ship in seven days. They waiting for me to cancel that order because I got a good deal on that phone, but I, you know I'm not canceling that order. They gonna ship me my phone, man. They gonna ship me my phone. They gonna ship it to me. It's bogus. They need to stop the nonsense. But Black Friday has been cool, man. Um, I don't I don't have any complaints about the stuff that I got. I'm really happy with the stuff that I purchased. Got some decent deals on stuff, and um, yeah, I'm ready, ready to get some more Black Friday deals going on, man. Uh, Gearbest got lost. I've been posting a few things from, for, about Gearbest stuff. You know, they got some some nice little deals going on. Uh, but locally, you know, what I'm saying most of the phones on Gearbest, I got them. You know, it's just kind of weird, but I got them already. So um, I'm excited, man, about my outer box. I like the iPad, uh, and I can't. My TV will be here Monday. I'm super excited about that. So uh, what did you guys get for Black Friday, man? Just want to chat with you for a minute. You know, what I'm saying and see what deals y'all got, and. Um, did anybody pick up any new cases or anybody get the new iPad? I see when I put that video out, a couple people said, "Hey, I got mine for you know from Amazon or whatever." But I'm pretty sure they still paid 250 because that's just the going price for the 2018 iPad. And the 2018 iPad is actually really nice, man. I really like it. And for 250 dollars, I could have got the 128 gig for uh, 299, I think it was or something like that. But I just didn't see the need. It's just it's just a Wi-Fi iPad that I'll keep downstairs in my little thing by my big recliners. And just fire it up and play games on it, you know what I'm saying? And write stuff down with the pencil and draw and stuff like that. Just something to kick back with, you know? Uh, but it's your man, J. Will. I will see you guys in the next video. Hope you guys enjoyed, man. Uh, and tell me down below some of the things that you guys picked up for Black Friday. Let's talk about it. See you in the next one. Take care.